it's FCA and I am home alone on Saturday the 15th, uh, March 15th, 2014. Um, yesterday, as you might have seen in my other video, which I'll link below, me and my friend April, we drank alcoholic beverages. I'm 24, just so we're clear. A lot of people don't believe me when I say that, but I promise. And so my stomach hasn't been feeling the best. I haven't felt nauseous or queasy. It just kind of feels off. Uh, mostly in the center, like right below my sternum. So I haven't eaten anything today. I've just been trying to sleep it off. And, yeah. But I woke up to no one home. My mom and dad have gone off to something for his work. My brother has gone to his work. I don't work today. I don't have a car. What am I supposed to do? And I can't leave the house until after 7.30 because... I'm watching, I promised my father I would watch a television thing that's coming up. So, so what I'm currently doing is I'm making myself more toner. So I have some apple cider vinegar and some mint green tea, which I am letting get nice and strong and steep. And then I ordered Chinese food. That's good, right? I ordered something that's semi-healthy. It's the beef with broccoli. I didn't want anything spicy because I had spicy yesterday and then I was drinking. Um, that wasn't too bad. It could have been a lot worse. Oh well. Um, so I just got that. They're coming to my house. I realized that I called this place so much because when I answered the phone, they were like, they were like, do you want this delivered to you? And then they said my house and I was like, yes, please. <laughs> I don't know if they just have that automatically in their computer or something. They must, I imagine so. Or either that or that's really pathetic that they know my voice and number that well. <sighs> oh well. And actually what I really wanted was pizza, but I don't have the cash. I, I only had $10 in cash. And otherwise I would have gotten pizza. I normally don't want pizza, but I was in the mood for it, but oh well. Beef and broccoli is just as good. I'm going to study, make, do some editing and YouTube videoing, and I'm really not doing anything exciting today. Um, I'm just alone. I don't like being alone. Um, I'm, I'm gonna do make some plushies, and I have a couple announcement videos and my alpha brain pills came in today. I'll show so you. So these are the alpha brain pills from Onnit.com. I I watch Rooster Teeth too much, but it's supposed to help increase your neurotransmitters and clear mental fog. And with my GRE exam coming up in a couple weeks, I figured that any kind of boost I could give myself, the lighting's probably awful, is good for me. And a nice little rest of the impromptu haul. Um, I have some fabrics here. I went to the fabric store and got five fabrics. And I need to go back and get three or four more. I like having fabric. I like sewing. So I have some projects planned for those. I will share those with you at another time, though. And I have to wait 45 minutes for my food, so I'm going to take my computer downstairs and do some editing and studying. So I'll talk to you all later. Bye. It's arrived. So here's my beef with broccoli and white rice. Uh, here's my fortune cookie. Two things of duck sauce, mustard, soy sauce, um, an egg roll, and some egg drop soup. I've never had egg drop soup. So that's going to be an exciting adventure. I have my chopsticks here, and I'm going to eat some yumminess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, I put dinner away, and I am, you can hear this noise. I'm printing off um, a sphere pattern and a machine checkoff list for my trainees. Monday, I'm going to be making a couple items, which I will tell you about in another video. I also plan on watching Cinderella 3. I've just, I've been listening to the song, but all well, these things are gonna fall. <laughs> but, 
um, that's what's going on in my life. I'm going to do a face mask and shower and things like that. I'm also going to try and get the rest of this nail polish off without nail polish remover because it's one of my Project 10 Pan things, so I can't buy it. I thought there was a little more left of it than there was. So, folly on me. I know, I have such a bromidic life. Uh, but that's the way we do things. So I'm going to go do that. And I will end the vlog after I get done doing some mask and other bits and pieces. I'm still home alone. Why do they do this to me? This <laughs> is what I have been working on as well. Um, I hope my friend doesn't see this because they're for Christmas presents. But they're going to be leaves. And I have them all pinned and ready to sew. But first, I need to get my sewing machine to work. It's the end of the Saturday vlog. I'm just going to go through a few things. I went and I got my pattern, which this is supposedly a pattern for a sphere, and I made another one that's a little bit bigger. And I cut it out onto this, and I have many of them. Here, I've already shown those, but here are these. And I would have continued and finished this, except that my sewing machine is being a pain in the butt right now because it need. Look at this. I'm sitting there trying to get the spool, so I want the thread on the spool, but look what happened. It, it didn't want to cooperate, and I, I gotta fix it, and then I got stressed. Um, let's see. Um, I put a star here because I didn't bite my nails today, so that's done. And um, I've just been working with my, my fabrics here. I watched a movie, I watched a bunch of YouTube videos while I've been sewing and things like that. I cleaned my makeup brushes, let me get out of my bedroom, and I made more toner for myself today, and now I'm going to be taking a bath. I have my bubble bath going, I'm going to be washing stuff on my computer, I'm going to do my scrub mask um, for exfoliation. I have a chunk of Rockstar soap here. And my candle going. And that is going to be it for today. And we've been having a little issue that I guess I'll share with you. Let me come back in here and turn this light on. But our neighbors in the duplex, the farther duplex door, they have been partying and being really loud and obnoxious and I know that I was kind of crazy in my intoxicated state last night in the video which I'll link below if I didn't already mention that however <laughs> I was in my room with a friend and we were being pretty quiet um, they are outside on the porch and on the lawn in the backyard and being loud drunk and obnoxious See, and you might be you might be able to hear that over like they're over why do I hear them and my family we don't ever call the cops on people for being loud because like oh they're college kids and they're doing their thing um, but our other neighbors are really really mad about that especially because it's midnight so pretty sure that cops might be called later 